Hey, good morning, everyone. Welcome to another learning day. Wanted to start another day with you with a short devotional. If you haven't noticed, I have a love for food. A great love, in fact. I love food and I'm so passionate about food. And I reckon if I didn't become a pastor, I reckon I would have been a chef. And in fact,、um, it, when I retire from pastoral ministry, I love to start a cafe and feed the people. Ah, the joy that the food brings to people is just so awesome. And I love food. Food certainly brings a lot of joy to me. Well, today, As we start today, I just wanted to share with you about the amazing chemistry of food. You know, food is just amazing, you know,、um, especially when it's cooked food. You know, the different kinds of flavor coming together and mingling in your mouth, the amazing chemistry it brings in your mouth, and boom! Ah, that amazing burst of flavors in your mouth. That amazing experience. Just so awesome. Today, you know, I just wanted to share some examples of what kind of flavors I'm talking about. Here, here's a banana, and here, here's a peanut butter. Who would have thought that peanut butter and banana go so well? Well, I tell you, my friends, these two mixed together in your mouth is just amazing. Let me try. So, here, here's a peanut butter. On top of the banana. My kids, they think that this is equivalent to eating a lolly. It's that good that my kids just love it. And you know, peanut butter and banana, you put it together like this, and all you have to do is to just open your mouth and have a bite. It goes like this. Amazing! Boom! You know, it's just incredible. These flavors mingling in your mouth. Amazing chemistry. I mean, this amazing flavor overflowing, connecting all the neurons in your brains. Saying, oh, this is yummy, 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 yum. Mm. Mm, mm. Incredible. I really encourage you to have it. Have a go. Peanut butter and banana. Now, that was just one example of a flavor. Amazing flavor. But here's another great example. Here's a cheese and here's a seaweed. Yes. Seaweed and cheese. Hey, you haters, you know, those who don't like sushi, don't be turned off just yet. You gotta try this. Man, trust me, if you love sushi, if you're a sushi lover, try this. A piece of cheese. And seaweed. All you have to do is you put them together, cover it in seaweed, and just chuck it in your mouth like this. The more you chew, the amazing flavor just bursts out. The amazing chemistry in your mouth. Science right there.、Mm. If you're a science guru, try this inside your mouth. Amazing chemistry.、Mm. Amazing. Delicious. Beautiful. Bella, Bella. Mmm, mmm, mmm. By the way, Bella means beautiful in Italian. Beautiful in Italian. Mmm, 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 mmm. Well, I wanted to bring these examples to you about flavors because I wanted to bring out an analogy of great taste, great flavors. Because you know what? There is a passage in the Bible found in Psalms chapter 34, verse 8. This is what it says Taste and see that the Lord is good. Did you hear that? Taste and see that the Lord is good. You know what? God is saying that, you know, He is so good. You know, the food brings this amazing joy into our hearts. Everyone loves eating food. It brings us life. It brings us joy. It brings us contentment. It quenches the hunger. Food is just amazing. And God is replacing Himself with this analogy of tasting that food and saying that I am that good too. This is an amazing passage because God is saying, I 
and so good. And not only the taste, you know, when amazing food is provided before our table, when it looks good in our eyes, oh, it brings more appetite. And God is saying that I don't only taste good, but I am great to look to, behold. And God is saying, I am so good, and all you have to do is try me. Now, some of you might have thought, oh, banana and peanut butter, oh, that's disgusting. Or some of you might thought, oh, cheese and seaweed, that is just so disgusting. Wait a minute. Until you have a go, when you try it, you might discover how good it is. And some of you who's on a journey, and I'm sure that a lot of you are on a journey, which is great. Now, some of you might have a preconceived idea thinking that, ah, this God business, don't like it, ah, it's rubbish. But have you ever tried it yourself? Or are you saying, I don't want God and those stuff at all without trying? Now, God is saying here, at least have a go, taste and see that the Lord is good. God is saying, at least give it a go and taste and see how good God is. Well, I took a bite and it's been part of my life. God is so good. And I hope that, you know, I can share that kind of experience with you guys too. And as you start this day, I pray for protection for each one of you. I pray for a wonderful day, a blessed day by God to you. Whether you, you are on a journey or whether you're not. May God bless you and have an awesome day. And may you taste and see that the Lord is good. Have a great day. God bless. Bye-bye.